I'm based out of California, but because I went to the Southwest Actors Conference and I follow Bella Hibbs on Instagram and I ended up with agents in Arizona and today is my orientation. So yes, I officially signed with an agency in Arizona. The orientation is in about 30 minutes and I don't know if I should wear this sweater. Maybe I should just put on like a not as casual shirt because this almost looks like a robe because it's so cozy. I should change, huh? This is a little better, still casual, but not too casual. And I think I'm gonna set up my zoom camera so it's like this. Um, this is an orientation, so I don't think I'm gonna be talking much, but they do want us to have the camera on probably to make sure that we're paying attention. They sent us the contract, so I already signed the contract and everything, I officially signed, and then they send us a bunch of notes about the what the Zoom call is gonna be about today. So I'm gonna review that now for it in case I need to know some information and in case I have any questions and I can ask them during the meeting. Oh my God. This is a PSA. Arizona doesn't observe the time change. So I was about 39-ish minutes late to the call. And that's because when I interviewed with them, when I did my audition to join the agency, the time hadn't changed. But now the time changed in California, but Arizona doesn't observe it. <laughs> The call was really great. I'm realizing, I mean, I always knew that everybody works slightly differently in the industry, but for this agency, an availability check means, oh, we just wanna know if you're available like December 1st to um, be in this commercial before we even send you in for the audition. And I'm used to, for my agents in San Francisco, an availability check means, hey, you're one of the few people that they're choosing, so we wanna make sure that you're available because they're trying to book you. Like completely different things. One's at the beginning of the audition process and one's at the end, like you're booked. Just sent them a quick email to apologize that I was late due to that time zone, so I need to be extra, extra careful with the time zones in Arizona. Oh, I feel so bad that I, I was late. But I don't feel like I missed anything super, super important. They'll let me know if I missed anything at the beginning. It's much later and it's time to do today's self tape. And do I have a reader? No, I don't. So let's hope it's a monologue or that I can easily record the other lines for this scene. I was thinking when there's a scene where the lines are overlapping, like it's not gonna work. And I know for a fact that there's scenes where they're overlapping and I'm realizing I'm jinxing myself now. So let's just see what's behind door number six. A Cinderella Christmas. What was this movie? I remember actually really liking this movie and wanting to watch the entire thing, but I just scrolled through it to find the scene. Ah, yes. So I have an evil stepsister cousin and basically she's like, you need to help me keep the prince, basically. My time is up, so I'm gonna film a couple of takes of this and I'm gonna do two different ones. One is gonna be the classic Cinderella. She's very sweet. And the other one I'm gonna make it that she's really assertive and she's like, trying to give her evil step cousin a run for her money. Oh my gosh, I basically have it memorized. I have this one pretty much down. Okay, let's try it again. Take two. I don't know, <laughs> it feels funny. Okay, now let's do the one where she's like fighting back a little bit. That one felt okay, let's do a third take. Here they are. Here are the two best takes that I did today. I'll see you tomorrow. I've seen this dress. What? No, you, you can't have. Yes, I have. It's all over the internet. Someone snuck a camera into the party and took a picture of the woman wearing this dress, dancing with Nicholas Carmichael. Behind the dress, well, this dress is very distinctive. It bears a striking resemblance to the mystery stocking. Oh, come on, Candace, don't let your imagination run wild. <laughs> you went to the ball. <sighs> Candace, I, I can explain. Uh, Christmas miracles don't need to be explained. Wait, what? You're happy? No, we can convince Nicholas that you or me. Oh, wait, what? No, 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 no. I don't think so. You have your very own successful event planning business? 
Let yourself free of me forever. And all you have to do is give Nicholas the little nudge that he needs to be mine. You want me to trick him? Well, you already tricked him. It was supposed to be me in this dress and at the ball. He invited me, not you. He was expecting me. And you said, we're perfect for each other. Maybe you're right. Maybe he was going to marry whoever went to the ball. That's the spirit. You can tell me about everything when I shop for my engagement outfit for tomorrow. I've seen this dress. No, you can't have. Yes, I have. It's all over the internet. Oh. Someone snuck a camera into the party and took a picture of the woman wearing this dress, dancing with Nicholas Carmichael. It was from behind, but the dress, well, this dress is very distinctive. It bears a striking resemblance to the mystery stocking. <laughs> oh, come on, Candace. Don't let your little imagination run wild. You went to the ball. <laughs> okay, Candace, I can explain. I to explain. Christmas miracles don't need to be explained. Wait, I'm confused. You're happy. I'm ecstatic. Now we can convince Nicholas that you were me. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. I don't think so. Not even to have your very own successful event planning business? All to yourself. Free of me? Forever? You want me to trick him? Let's give Nicholas the little nudge that he needs to be mine. <laughs> you want me to trick him? Well, you already tricked him. It was supposed to be me in this dress and at the ball. He invited me, not you. He was expecting me. And you said, we're perfect for each other. Maybe you're right. Maybe he was going to marry whoever went to the ball. That's the spirit. You can tell me about everything when I shop for my engagement outfit for tomorrow. 